Hi guys, welcome to Get Curried. This is the Bombay chef Varun Nandar, and today I get a very typical Bombayya street food to you. It's called the Anda Burji or the Egg Burji. Let's begin. Anda Burji is a spicy scrambled egg for which I'm going to use some onions and chop them finely. Onions are cut and ready. In a moderately hot pan, I'm adding in a little bit of oil, and along with this, some butter. While the butter is still melting, I'm sliding in the chopped onions. A quick stir, and allow these onions to sweat a little. In the interim, let's chop the chilies and ginger. I'm just going to snip the stalk and chop these roughly. Well, this too now goes with the onions. A quick mix, and while this is sautéing, let's chop some tomatoes. The tomatoes are chopped and ready. Also, the onion, ginger, and chili have sautéed well. Time to add in the tomatoes and continue sautéing it till it becomes nice and pulpy. To aid this process, I'm just sprinkling a little bit of salt. Along with this, let's start adding the powder spices. The first one that goes in is some turmeric. The next, red chili powder. This can be as per your choice because remember you've also added some green chilies and finally the magic spice powder which all Mumbai stall owners by default have it in their kitty so here is the pav bhaji masala a nice mix just make sure the masala is just cooking well this is the time when the flame can be lowered and the masalas need to cook nicely for 5 to 7 minutes in the interim Let's break the eggs and start whisking them. A little bit of salt to season the eggs. Remember, the masalas already have the salt. And now, let's whisk this. the beaten eggs go straight in the mixture this needs to be mixed nicely and evenly on a very slow flame keep scraping the sides now that this mixture has mixed well you can increase the flame a little and just make sure you keep stirring it till it's completely well done One thing which is important for you to know is that an egg cooks at 60 degrees. So any temperature beyond that the egg is well done. But here you can keep stir frying it if you think you need it drier or you need it a little moist. That choice is yours. The burji is done and ready. Off goes the flame and now let's add in some fresh coriander. So here you have your ultimate Bombayya style burji pav which is done and ready. Do try this at home. Do like, do share, do subscribe to the channel and tag us on social media. Not only when you make this at home, but also when you eat this outside with your friends. Have fun.